This video will cover how to use the Customer Support Center on Illinois WorkNet to update user management. Once you are logged into Illinois WorkNet, go to the ribbon across the top that says My Dashboard, click on the down arrow, go to the Customer Support Center. Look for the icon at the top that looks just like the silhouette of a man's head. Depending on the level of access that you have, you may see other icons, but this is the one that you're looking for. Click on the icon. Once here, you can begin looking for the customer that you need to add or update, or you can add a partner to a group all in one convenient screen. By typing someone's name in the search box, you can see if they already have an Illinois WorkNet account. Click Search. I'm not finding anybody with status in the database, so I'm going to add a partner to the group. I've typed in the information and I am now going to select the agency to which I want to add the customer. I'll now want to search for that customer to see if they're already in the system. No account has been found, so I want to search non-active accounts. Since there was no account found in the non-active, I would like to create an account, so I'm going to click Yes, and then I'm going to Add Partner. It gives you the user's name and password so that you can share that with the user. And if you're ready to move on to the next person, all you have to do is click Close. Now I want to make sure to search for the user. I type in the user's name, click Search, the user shows up. If I need to make any changes to the user profile, I click on their last name, You'll see the user management tab that you can click on to ensure that everything is properly addressed when you set up the user management. If things change and you need to give this customer, if things change and you need to give this user access to enhance their user management capabilities, just check this box. Now I'm going to demonstrate how to find a user who already has an established account. I'm going to click in the search bar the user's name and click search. The user will show up and it will show you how they're associated. If you need to add a group to that user, just click on the plus symbol and then you can add the group but first fill in any items that are not already there. They may have a new email address. Then select a group. Then you will click Add Partner. Since this user already has a username and address, they will not show the username and password that you have for that user. If you need to delete someone from a group, just click the red X. That's it for our user management tool. Have a great rest of your day.